obvious. The lo and behold. Oh, it's real obvious. Okay? Because, as most of sure, most of y'all have figured out the uh, symbol I call the hexagonic star because that's really what it is it's a hexagonic star right you've got your upside triangle and your downside triangle okay and that's your first six points one two three one two three okay and then you got a hexagon and we all know the hexagon is as a cult as it gets when it comes to occult symbolism right in the middle of that thing on the Israeli state flag is a hexagon and of course that's got six sides right there's your second six and then of course the hexagon has got six points. So bam, that's six, six, six right there on the symbol. Now, when you put all that together and weigh it against any other theories out there, right? And then on top of that, you start humbly asking Almighty above, Please help me see this clearly. I truly, truly want to know what this mark of the beast is. Okay? I don't want to teach falsely to others. I don't even want to share what I think it is until I'm absolutely sure. Because I know you frown upon false teachers okay so I did humbly ask God I did not get an immediate answer all right but let me tell you something eventually eventually just start putting it in my head it's like an equal sign okay mark of the beast equal sign the flag of the state of Israel that symbol bam with the lightning flash okay and really that's just you know and then it happened again and Jah confirmed it again and Jah confirmed it again and again wake up two days later and Jah confirms it yet again and now you see like I said it's been a really good amount of time. There's no doubt whatsoever. So, you know, maybe three weeks ago, some brother on Facebook was like, Yo, the mark of the beast is the crucifix. And he had, like, all these numbers translated from Strong's. And, uh, and I was like, Yo, man, you know, it sounds like you, you intellectually picked it all apart and reasoned it I said you know you're probably better off just going to the source ask Jah what the mark of the beast is ask Jah if the mark of the beast is the Catholic crucifix okay and be real humble and listen real careful don't be listening but wanting your answer to be the right one See, I'm a little bit more trained in that regard because I'm a trained scientist. Okay, we're trained to be objective. We don't want a certain result to occur. We objectively watch and observe and whatever result occurs, bam, that's the one we put down. So, you know, anyway, that was my long answer for basically the, the title of this sermon, if you all don't mind me using that word, this lesson, 